friends, this video is the first EFT of A World of Our Own. A World of Our Own is a monthly newsletter containing a bundle of spiritual offerings that are formulated to help individuals release narratives deeply embedded in the mainstream consciousness that impede upon wellness and energetic sovereignty. Each month I will be putting out an EFT, meditation, tarot video, and newsletter all under a common theme. If you feel you'd benefit from these offerings, subscribe to this channel and to the newsletter linked in the description box. So this particular month is all about letting go and releasing codependency. If you're not familiar with emotional freedom tapping technique, it is a scientifically proven somatic technique that helps us release stored emotions and narratives that are trapped within the energetic and etheric body. And through moving these narratives out, we can make space for a new story. In today's EFT, we will be choosing to move on from a relationship that is no longer serving us, and this EFT seeks to help us process and release all resistance to letting go. Using this somatic technique, we will work towards a state of acceptance and peace, letting go with love and a clear heart. So let's begin, and if you haven't done EFT before and aren't familiar with the points, no worries, just follow along with me, and there will also be captions below for everything that I'm saying. Okay, so starting at this point. I feel angry. I feel misunderstood, unseen. I feel disrespected and hurt. I feel disappointed, sad, upset. I feel scared, scared of letting go of this relationship. I'm grieving the loss of a potential that I held in my heart. I don't like letting go. I don't like impermanence. Change makes me feel out of control. How I was treated makes me feel out of control. There's a part of me that wants to hold on, even though I know it is time to let go. I try to keep this attachment alive, revisiting things in my mind over and over again. In this rumination, the voice of doubt keeps speaking. If only I had done things differently, maybe I made the wrong decision. If only they could see it my way. If only they could have acted different. If only I could have acted different. If only we could have acted in accordance with the potential that I now envision. This voice of doubt is the part of me resisting change. The part of me that wants to control. The part of me that doesn't trust in the flow of life. The part of me that fears I will not be able to find anything to fill the space that has been created. But I know it is time to let go of this fear, this resistance. I affirm to my mind, body, and spirit that in letting go, I am making space in my life to let something more nourishing in. I let go of codependency, the belief that another person could be the source of my happiness or joy. I let go of needing the situation to be any different than it is because I trust that all is happening in accordance to divine will for the greatest and highest good of everyone involved. I let go of needing this person to be any different than they are. They are free and I am free. As people enter and leave my life, that means their purpose has been served. I allow myself to be filled with the gratitude of experience. I know that there are no mistakes, only lessons and growth. I no longer resist change. I no longer resist pain. I am safe to let go. Letting go is an important part of life. Letting go is an important part of my evolution and my unfolding. As I let go, I let in. I let in new loves. I let in a new version of myself. I let in a fresh beginning. I let go with gratitude. 
I let go with forgiveness. I let go with a clear heart. My mind is letting go of this relationship deeply and completely. My body is letting go of this relationship deeply and completely. My spirit is letting go of this relationship deeply and completely. My whole being surrenders to the beautiful flow of life deeply and completely. Now take a deep breath in and release as you breathe out any residue emotion, anything from the session, just let go. So thank you so much for sharing your precious time and energy with me today. Uh, EFT, like all somatic techniques, it's something that we revisit as the emotion comes up. So anytime you feel those emotions coming up of resistance, of anger, of pain, of rumination, revisit this video and just use it to help kind of clear out those emotions and tap in new emotions and the new narrative that will be supportive in this process. So there will be a meditation and tarot video also coming out um, as well that is under the theme of letting go to offer more support. So if that interests you, please subscribe, click the notification bell so that you get notification when those videos come out. Um, and if that you're watching this video a couple months after the release date, there will be other EFTs, tarot videos, and meditations to check out on my channel and also through my newsletter. Um, and then also check out a World of Our Own newsletter, which the link to subscribe is in the description box below. We're going to be doing monthly spiritual offerings under different themes. Um, and also an archive of the newsletter will be up if you're watching this video a while from now. So you can read through those writings and check out the resources in that in those particular months. So I hope this offering brought you some peace and I hope you have a beautiful day. Again, thank you for sharing your time with me.